Hello and welcome to Maria's Marbella. It's been such a long time since I've been in TV, but I'm back again and I'm very happy to be back with you all. So I hope you enjoy the show today. Uh, we have lots coming up uh, in the program. We have uh, two very talented children called Amy and Taylor, who I'm going to be interviewing in a minute. We have a lovely lady friend of mine. Her name is Anna Pearson. She's a medium, so we're going to do a little bit of contacting with the spirit world, but not today, uh, later on on another show, but you will get to meet her as an introduction. And we've also got some really, really good beauty treatments coming up. It's a facelift without the surgery, so I'm sure you'll be interested in that. And to start off the show, I'd like to introduce you to two very, very talented children. Amy, well actually they're not quite kids anymore, they're quite <laughs> grown up now. If I'm right, I think Amy is uh, 15 and uh, Taylor is 13. And um, here they are in the studio with me. So welcome to the show. Hello. How are you? Hello. Good. We're nice okay. to have you. Have I got your ages right? Um, <laughs> well, you got my sisters right, but I am 14. Oh, you're 14. Yeah. Okay. So you are both singing. You're both brother and sister. Yes. You sing together. Yes. You rap. I've seen your video clip on YouTube. It's absolutely amazing. Oh, thank, thank you. you. And um, everybody who I've showed it to since then, they've all said the same thing. So oh, I'm yeah. sure you're both going to go a very long way. Thank you. But oh, okay. tell me, yeah, I'm sure it will. But let's start from way back. When did this start? How old were you? How did it all happen? Since you could walk. <laughs> yeah. Really? Yeah. Really. What, that long? Mum's a singer, so... Oh, okay. So her. you so it, it runs in the family then, uh, huh? Dad isn't yes. really. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not really it's really quite funny because um, I used to do jazz, but then a friend of mine introduced me to some rap music. So I, I, I'm quite diverse when it comes to music. Yeah, because I heard somebody told me that you're really good at kind of like the Frank Sinatra kind yeah, of songs, yeah, yeah. and uh, so you, you're quite you're quite diverse, and you can go from Frank Sinatra to rapping. Yeah, uh, which is a good thing. It's fantastic. Think, yeah. What's ki what kind of music do you like though? Uh, Anything Amy? as long as it's got like a little bit of like so I can feel it. If I don't feel it, it's, it's no mm -hmm. point in singing it. Yeah. So um, yeah, as long as. I uh -huh. get the feeling. You know. So tell me then, do you both want to make it together and stick together, or do you think you're uh, uh, going your separate well, ways? We like singing together. Well, yeah. I mean, it, it's nice when we sing together. We feel comfortable. But like, I don't know. Later on in life, m maybe we we'll probably go our separate ways. You never know what happens. So. Yeah. yeah. I think this is quite unique, though, brother and sister, don't you think? <laughs> I mean, I don't know of any famous singers <laughs> that are <laughs> but, well. I wouldn't call them uh, talented though, would you? <laughs> I, mean, <laughs> I mean, come on. <laughs> but I mean, you two are far more superior than, than those two guys and your brother and Thank sister. You. And uh, Thank you. I think it's quite special actually that you both do this together. It's, it's mm. unique. Mm. I mean, I don't know of any big celebrity singers that are brother and sister and singing together. Yeah. yeah. And you've actually got a really good rapport uh, going because I saw you both on the video and you actually. You know, you can yeah, see yeah, the yeah. connection. So, what do your friends say about it? Oh, well. <laughs> well they're like, oh my God, my English friends, they can sing. The thing is, it's because we live in Rhonda, so they're all yeah. Spanish, mm -hmm. so they, they already like it. So. Oh, excellent. And what about your teachers at school? Oh. Have they heard you we singing? Actually, um, we, we try to avoid our teachers seeing it because they're very. Um, Oh my God, we have to show it to everyone. Oh. So, um, I don't know, it's just a bit embarrassing. So everyone's really excited, really, for yeah. you both. Mm. Uh, but this is what you want to do as your future career. Yes. yes. Both of you, mm. definitely. Yes. Yeah. Uh, singing is just amazing. Love it. Mm. Oh my goodness. It's like um, uh, winning by winning. Uh -huh. So you're doing something that you really enjoy and you're getting stuff from it. Mm -hmm. yeah, even if, so. you, if, if we don't get anywhere, I, I don't care. As long as I can... Like, just sing whenever I want. That's fine with me. Oh, that's nice, isn't it? Isn't it? Mm. So what, what happens if you become really famous and <laughs> you forget all about our little TV studios then, don't no, you? No, 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 no. <laughs> you know, you want the big ones then, won't you, eh? The National and Internet. No, we'll never forget you, don't worry. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> well, I'll tell you what we're going to do now. We're going to have a look at your video clip on uh, YouTube and uh, show, it, show it to everybody what you're all about. So let's have a look at the video clip of Amy and Taylor singing.
Drag my bag to sit the plane today A little too much fun on tour Too much fun on tour Lord, please help me find my keys Or I'm banging down my own door All the cheering, all the applause Who could ask for more? Ask for now more? I wouldn't mind finding a real thing Ready when my back's finally hit the floor Time I come on TV waiting for me I've been thinking lately that life alone is crazy I wanna own somebody where I don't sleep Who's gonna be the one to save me? Will I ever settle down? All I do is run around This is taking too long Cause I'm fed up, lonely, no longer the old me Right now we could do some company, need someone to call my cold You're taking too long, hurry up, come to the rescue, fly away with me and hold me I cherish you like a trophy, if that night had to be the show me Where I get down here is a no-go, can't keep on flying solo I don't wanna have to wait all my life, I say this Casey and Joe Joe Now I Wow, it's brilliant, absolutely amazing you. video you, clip. God, you must be so proud of yourselves when you see yourself like that singing. Yeah, well, I, we, both of us, like to put the effort in to make something just right. Yeah, I still see all the little faults there, and it's like, oh! But, um, well, I mean, I didn't see any faults there at all. I thought you were both fantastic. And thank you. you both thank really you. gave it your all. It was fabulous. And a beautiful place where you filmed in Rhonda. Yeah, it's about yeah, yeah, yeah. stunning. Really, really good. So tell me then, Taylor, how did you get into rapping? So, Taylor, tell me, how did you get into rap singing? Um, well, I started because a, a friend of mine introduced me to it and he said, listen to this, and it was very different for me. I didn't like it at the beginning, but then I um, started looking into the history of the artists and finding out some really interesting stuff. So then I wanted to learn how to start rap and how you really um, learn how to rap properly. Mm -hmm. So I, I heard about um, uh, some people like Eminem, 
uh, Jay Z, that I've been in rap battles and freestyling concerts, which is really, it's a rap battle is where two people uh -huh. diss each other. So, <laughs> so it's it's quite a funny story. But the thing is, you can't take it personally. But the idea is, is not to diss each other to to you know get haters or hate each other. Uh -huh. The idea is is you've got to make up bad things about this person or well you've got to say like um, if they were dressed bad then you would say about that uh -huh. if if you know you didn't like them or you know um, they had an attitude you would say about that but you have like two minutes and they give you a beat and you have to rap spontaneously to that beat against oh. them Goodness. and that's how I got into well, rap music. That's I mean that has to come naturally a uh, talent as now you said spontaneously yeah. you've got to think of the words and, and rhyme it as you go along that must be really hard I couldn't do that. Yeah well at, at the beginning it is because I, I went on a few rap battles and I choked a, a lot of times but um, really after three say two years if you haven't got it yet then you might as well give up. You never it, will. It, it, yeah <laughs> but the trick is just to practice and practice and practice and practice and as soon as it comes to you, you'll just be rhyming with anything. You could talk about um, different colours between chairs and make them rhyme. You could talk about anything walking across the street, cars, um, signs, wow. everything. So come on then, give us a little demonstration. I'm going to put you spontaneously now <laughs> to the test. Okay. <laughs> Go for it. So, here I am on Maria TV with my sister A Marie, yeah, and me TC to the P. Don't be surprised if you see me in five years on the multi platinum C to the D or on a DV to the D. You see, I'm the best, better than all the rest. Yes, I impress, my skill is so ill. Yeah, I can do it. Yeah, I'm the best, I can do it like crazy. My lyrical writing is lazy, no, it's not, it's crazy. When I'm sitting on the couch a, watching a bit of TV, I do it with my sister Amy, but when we get on stage, we're the best. Man, we can rip it like crazy. My lyrical writing is so amazing, I'm so spontaneous. My name is TCP with the Y alias. <laughs> <laughs> Give me a round of applause. <laughs> That's fantastic, well done. I mean, that is just done by you just thinking that as yeah. you go along. Well, amazing. Yeah. Brilliant. Well, I think you're, you're both going to go a very, very long way, uh, for sure. So um, you have to come back when you're stars. I'm going to chase you somewhere <laughs> along the line. Okay. <laughs> but um, what about, uh, you know, you, you girlfriend? You, yeah. you got a boyfriend? Or no. And no. What I does your mind. girlfriend think about this? Oh, well, um, she, she loves it. Does she? Sh she, um, does she want you to be a celebrity? Famous, uh, and have all the girls after you and screaming at you. Not, and not, really not, <laughs> not really, not really. <laughs> she says, "Oh, you're gonna leave me when you're famous." Oh. But it was funny one story because um, we were in class one day, and um, she's and she had the hump. Don't know why, you know. But anyway, she just um, she just does apparently. Oh. But um, she said to me, she said, um, she said, "Oh, you're gonna leave me soon because I was saying that I was gonna come here." And she said, "Oh, here, here you are. You're going off to some, you know, big show." And I was like, <laughs> and she said, "You're gonna get famous soon." And I was like, um, "No, I'm not." And then I said, uh, I said to my teacher, I said, um, "Can I um, stand in front of the stage and, and ask my girlfriend something?" I said, and he said, "Yeah, yeah, yeah." He said, "So," <laughs> he, he, I said, "You laugh." I said to the teacher, and he said, "So." I went in front of the whole class, I said, I said, can, I, can everyone um, quiet down please? And I said, Camilla, can I spend the rest of my life with you? I said, oh my god, you didn't tell me that! Oh my romantic. god! You're a bit of a romantic, you are, aren't you? No, it just really annoyed me that she oh. said that. So yeah, well, I did. That's such a lovely thing to say. How mm. wonderful is that? Well, I think you're a lovely, lovely guy. You're going to go a long way. You're beautiful, Amy. You've got a great voice on you, both of you, and I wish you all the very best of luck. And thank you so much for coming on to Maria's Marbella Show. Thank you for inviting us. And I'd love to You're have you so back welcome. again any time. Thank so you. Good night.